careful guys driving around. And to give us a great idea of what's going on uh, in and around the Metroplex right now, the 10,000 square miles worth of uh, Metroplex, uh, is my good friend Dan Brunoff, who joins us down. He's from 1080 uh, AM. Dan, you are in Fort Worth right now. Uh, give it. What, what are you seeing on the roads? Where, where are some of the worst spots right now? Well, the, the worst spots are on the interior roads. Uh, I did take a trek from Fort Worth to Denton, which is one county and one town uh, north of Fort Worth, about 25 miles or so, yesterday That's evening right. and again this morning. And things are a little better on the highway. Tech Stop's done a great job and with the magnesium chloride that we're using now and our uh, limited number of snow clouds. They've done a great job on the interstates, but again, the interior roads have the worst problems. And, and where would you say avoid today? Where are the big, where's everything stacking up? Everything's stacking up pretty much uh, on the interior roads. We have that glaze of ice now from the okay, so bit of snow, uh, ice melt we saw yesterday, and uh, now refroze overnight. So that thin layer of ice, much more dangerous to drive on than the actual sleep. Plus, we have another winter storm uh, possible. This will be an all snow yes. event. We'll start yes. after midnight tonight. Exactly. So tomorrow, instead, Sam, of changing. Thanks, Bruni. Uh, love you, man. Thanks, thanks for taking the time. It, instead of starting off by watching the precip change and getting the sleet and whatnot, we will start off as snow, as Dan says. Already got the winter storm watches posted. Could be anywhere from one to four inches. Just depends on where it lines up. And this will be an issue that we will watch go all the way east on I-20 through Birmingham.